Hello, welcome to Coco Candle Channel. It's been a long time since I last made the video. I think it was last year. Um, I've been uploading some Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year video to all. And those who watch, to all those who watch, thank you very much. Um, I stopped making videos because I was on vacation and I was really very, very preoccupied um, doing a lot of personal things. But And also I have not um, purchased any new tarts or candles so this video actually is just a uh, beginning of the year inventory and just to see what I still have and I told myself that I will have to melt and use all of my candles and tarts and really think about 2013 whether I will continue to to buy sorry to buy more tarts and candles. As you know, I live over overseas and ordering from the US is not always the best option. The shipping cost is very expensive and there's just too many vendors out there and um, I realize that I'm really spending quite a lot of um, um, cash to, to support this particular hobby of mine. But um, I told myself I'll finish everything. It's not that I have a lot. Um, I just have a handful or not not really a lot but you'll see it now so what you see here today is actually are the tarts that I have to melt for the next few months okay so let me show you this one as you know those of you who have watched um, I went to a wax museum and they made a mold of my hand of my right hand so this is really so nice and um, as gifts for Christmas, I did receive a couple of candles. This is Yankee Candle Sparkling Snow. I really love the winter scent. And as you know, here where I come from, we don't have four seasons. It's either summer or rainy season. So, But having this can make you feel that you're in a winter wonderland. I, I got this from an exchange gift in the office. It's called... Um, Travelers, I think it's from Karma Kamet. It's a local brand. Um, she told me that this is uh, a Travelers um, can tea light candle in a lavender scent. So I have not opened it up yet, but it's so nice of her to give me something that I truly appreciate. I was also given a Yankee Candle um, Coastal Waters. I have never tried this before, but looking at the picture, it I think this is a fresh yeah, it is a fresh scent. And um, I can't wait to start using it. So it smells more of a man's cologne. Um, I'm not really a fan of that, but um, I'll check and try and see whether I'll enjoy it. At the background, you will see that I have a Candelicious um, match sticks that came free. And these are just the three towers from Ikea that I bought. And I think that's in pomegranate um, scent. And as you know, behind I have my unscented tea lights in a very nice um, candle dish. But for this particular warmer, I think this one I did pop in um, Country Home Scents Orange Ginger. So I can fully smell the, the ginger scent and the fresh orange. So it's, it's filling up the air right now. <laughs> I'm in a candle mode today. So here I still have my Tiffany candles. This is, I guess, um, Peppermint and Candy Cane. This is one of my blends, custom blends, that I bought from Tiffany Candles. It's taken me a while before I finish all the candle jars, jar candles that I bought. I have here, it still smells very good. This is Fruitopia. I decided, ah, I think this is the week, weekless candle, so I did put this in my coffee mug warmer, and it was really very strong. That at one point I brought it to the office and I had to to, to shut the the warmer down because it was um, creating a lot of strong scent in a good way for me. But if you are not a, a candle person or a tarts person, then you will not like it. And here I also decided to put this in my candle warmer. This is my Tiffany candles. And I think this is... Um, Okay, I don't remember it well now. I think this is Serendipity and Strawberry Passion. I may be wrong, but I'm still enjoying it. I bought that quite a long time ago, maybe three months ago. 
but I am still enjoying it to the maximum level. This I have lavender and sweet dreams. This I have been melting inside my bedroom and also in the living room and it's really very nice relaxing scent and I don't know if you can see behind there's one more here in my candle cage that is some um, apple mango tango and gain so it's a very fresh laundry scent that I have here so let me just move around the things that I have I also wanted to show you some of the front porch that I still have I'll not give scent descriptions this is just an inventory video so I have strawberry ice cream in four packs glory days this I got from a D stash from Sarah Face 87 um, bountiful blessings smooching by the fire I heard so many things about that I have not tried it so I have to try it back porch from front porch then there's a back porch uh, flip-flops I'm not sure about the scent description but this is cactus and sea salt mmm smells good so Danish vanilla cake orange chiffon ice cupcakes pumpkin spice cake as you know I'm not a fan of bakery but I have quite a lot but it's okay if I mix it with fruits or other scents then I get to enjoy it pink vanilla oak crescent rolls pink orange pastry I think I did other videos wherein I did explain my cold review Nana's banana pudding I know that you love banana pudding smooching by the fire um, pumpkin bread lavender hydrangea this is very strong pink home eucalyptus I still have quite a lot of front porch so blue strawberry sugar corn pudding turtle cheesecake pumpkin clove I'm not a fan of cloves purple cow what is purple cow I really don't know red velvet cupcake it's cut into half so I guess I have used this up before the holidays orange lime pie candle shop I want to my house to smell like a candle shop peppermint patchouli pumpkin cinnamon rolls moonlight blossoms so I still have a lot to melt and enjoy orange marshmallow Danish. I'm not sure whether there's an expiration date for tarts, but um, I guess I will not be purchasing unless I completely finish all my my um, stack right now. I have some um, wax cubes left. I have salted lime margarita. I still have three cubes left. I have the bathing garden, crystallized spearmint, and peppermint. This one I melted last night, so as you can see, it's already distorted here. But I melted two cubes, and it was very refreshing, clean, and um, invigorating scent. So this usually happens with the bathing garden fall leaves over far sides. The, the plastic really becomes very, very soft, so I guess this one I have to use pretty fast before it melts away. And... I have breakaway melts from Fasas McGee and this is a uh, monkey business. I have not used that at all. I still have Christmas tree from Tiffany Candles. Come on, come on, I wanna want ah, come on, I wanna Leia. This is from Tiffany Candles as well. And a few more from Bathing Garden. This is poison poison apothecary. And okay, it's becoming soft, so I think I better use it up before the rest. Um, Christmas blender so this arrived quite late after actually after Christmas that's why I was not able to use all the Christmas scents one more from Fasas McGee which is the marshmallow so let me just move this away and cranberry chiffon from bathing garden serendipity I love love serendipity from Tiffany candles 
And here is pink pomegranate. My favorite scent is anything with pomegranate. Lemon mint. This is very good. I've used up three. And last from Baiting Garden, I have Apple Crisp. Belmort. I'm not sure what is Belmort. And Country Christmas. I'm not sure whether I'll save this for Christmas 2013, but maybe I'll use it up. Um, so that they will not go into waste. So as you can see, I still have quite a lot of um, melting to do. And I really don't plan to purchase anything um, more. So I still have Yankee Votives. I use this as a tart. Lilac, orange, ocean blossom, sugared apple, white gardenia. Sometimes I have bad luck, sometimes I have good luck in terms of using Yankee Candle votives. A starts lakeside birch, willow breeze, white gardenia. So mostly they're fruity and floral. Sicilian lemon, another one. Coconut Bay, Vanilla Lime, my favorite, Honeydew Melon, Cilantro, Pineapple Cilantro, Treehouse Memories, I've not used this, Spring Days, Beach Flowers, Evening Air, Country Kitchen, Tropical Pineapple, um, Pink Honeysuckle, Storm watch. So as you can see, I still have a lot. Sandalwood. This is uh, cherry vanilla. Black cherry. True rose. Cranberry chutney. So just order eliminating another sugared apple. And this is Oasis. Sandalwood, I have two of those. Uh, Blue Hydrangea, Garden Hideaway, Soft Blanket, Vineyard, and Crisp Linen. I ordered this from eBay quite a long time ago and haven't finished it yet. Sun Kissed Leaves, and Another Good Air, and this one is Crisp Linen. Third Sandalwood. Garden Hideaway, and this is Sun Kissed Leaves, and last three Oasis, Greenhouse, and Island Flower. So I'll have to use that all up so that I can. I think I won't be, I'm sorry to say, but I think I won't be purchasing anymore. And I'll just have to watch all your videos and enjoy everyone's videos. For the time being, I have from Candelicious Votives, which I use as starts as well, fresh linen. And this is, I think this is uh, cranberry orange. I may be wrong. Uh, odor, uh, odor eliminator. And this one is uh, fruits, fresh, juicy fruit. So those are the ones from Candelicious. And... It was suggested before that um, I can use this uh, wallflowers as um, oil for the burner. So I still have leaves. I still have uh, warm vanilla sugar. I know that I do have, um, what do you call it, um, sweet pea, uh, winter candy apple, and apple crumble. My only one spray, um, mint, mint chocolate. I, I love this to death. And I still have a few of the country home scents, um, Snow Angels, Ginger Brulee, Rainy Days, uh, Day at the Spa, and more votives. I have Sparkling Cinnamon, I have Christmas Cookie, uh, Mountain Pine, and this is an Apple Spice Popuri, and a few, a few tarts. I have the Holiday Garland, I have Autumn Wreath, um, Festival Flights, Icicles, and last three, Mistletoe, Holiday Bayberry, and another Mistletoe. 
So I did not use all the Christmas scents during the holidays. Maybe I didn't have enough time to to melt all of the the tarts. I have this um, hearts from Candelicious. I think these are um, heart shaped tarts in a bag. Heart melt. So it comes in uh, lavender heart melts. They used to smell very good, but lately, when I try them after a long time, after 10 years, I think I didn't like them anymore. I have a few from the candles from the keeping room. This is Amish Friendship Bread. This is Country Sweet Rolls. Only I only have two, actually. Honey Jew and Cream from LOL. And I still have from Tiffany, I think this is Mexican... I forgot something Mexican. I don't know what this is. I think this is from Kim Starts. And I have some generic um, cubes such as apple cider, bakery scent, and cookies, and whatever it is. And hold on, give me a few minutes. Last but not the least, I have. Actually, this was in my bag. These are actually um, from the bathing garden. As you can see, there are two cubes of each scent. I wanted to melt this in the office, but they started sneezing. So I decided to just bring it home again today and maybe try my luck next time when I can use and enjoy my tarts and my candles in the office. So there you have it. Um, this is the coffee table so you will see that these are the candles and tarts that I will be using up for the next few months um, and like what I've said I will not be ordering any more for this year as much as possible I'm going to refrain from ordering just to be able to really um, not really waste my money on tarts. It's not that I am against it, but it's just a conscious effort and decision that I have made during the start of the year. So I will still continue to watch your videos. I will still continue to make cocoa candle reviews if I can, but you will see me pop in and out of YouTube. And um, to all my subscribers, thank you very much for for supporting all my videos and um that's it okay goodbye